Hello everybody, Multiman37 back here with a Throwback Thursday review, this time of the Deluxe Deno belt from Kamen Rider Deno. This is the belt used by, uh, uh, what was his name, uh, Ryotaro to transform into Kamen Rider Deno and use the power of his four core imagining. And it comes with a few things. You've got the rider tickets, with it, which I am holding in this uh, card sleeve. Um, the pass and the belt, which I will be wearing later on. Um, but for now, I'm just doing it like this. So, let's take a look at the box, then the tickets, then the pass, then the belt. Um, which I'll show the belt up close first before I do it, before I switch over to rider cam. So, yeah. The front, we got a picture of Kamen Rider Deno holding up the pass in sword form. Uh, um, you got the five tickets included, the pass. Um, this is the super best version, so uh, this is the re-release version that has all the tickets and everything. Well, it doesn't have the Dengasher. I do want the Dengasher, though. It's a pretty cool weapon. Um, on this side, you've got Deno in... Uh, sword, rod, axe, and gun form. Sword form on this side. Obviously it says super best right there. You got the sword form light. Rod form light. Axe form light. Gun form light. On the bottom, you got the five tickets included. The Momotaros, Urataros, Kintaros, Ryutaros, and blank tickets. And then on the back is everything you're going to do with this. The forms, and um, this thing is really unfocused, um, the five tickets, and even promotes the Dengasher and the Kataros. I have the Kataros, so I don't have the Dengasher. But that will be for another time. So, yeah. Um, let's start with the tickets. So, here are the tickets. I have them in these little uh, card sleeves, and so yeah, we have the Momotaros Imagine Ticket with the date uh, January 28th, 2007, that's what the 1 and 28 stand for. We have Urataros with January 20th, 2000, or actually that was 2007, this is 2008. Uh, we have Kintaros with uh, May 21st, 2006. Then we got Ryutaros, which his is done out a little bit differently. First, his has purple on the side, and of course it says Deno. They all say Deno, because they are Deno brand tickets. Um, there are three types of tickets. You got Deno, Zeranos, and Gao. And then you got this stamp says, um, no expiration, so this can be used forever. This is actually the ticket that Ryutaros used to get on the Denliner. And then this is the blank ticket that is used to um, uh, call up for when what time period they need to go to in case a Imagine goes through time. And then they have to use it in Denliner, and yada, yada, yada. And we had the Rider Pass done out in this black plastic. It's almost a matte black, I think, but, uh, mine's a little broken. The tab here broke, but I can live with that. It's still fine. Um, you do have the clear window right here. That's where the ticket goes. The Dino logo there. And then, of course, this folds out. And the way you put in the tickets, I'm going to just show this off with a blank ticket only. Uh, you put in the ticket like that, and then, of course, to take it out, there's a hole so that you can take it out. That's it. So, then we got the belt itself, which this is the type 2, I think this is type 2 belt, where this side only unclamps, only one side unclamps, the other does not. It even has a caution sign, and it does fold in for the Kataros. Yeah, the chrome on the border here is chipping away, and then the border does come off because the Kataros. And the, the reason this is paint it wasn't originally paint, it was originally chrome, but I painted it over because it was getting chipped away, and I thought this would look a lot better, and sure as hell it does. It's a uh, very sparkly, so it works just as good. So, got the metallic blue arrow, 
um, which of course, uh, I guess is pointing to the light, and then the red, that should have been off, the, actually, okay, yeah, you can see it on the light, uh, the red, blue, yellow, and purple buttons, and then the belt straps, which are connected to the, uh, belt extenders. They're all designed after train tracks, which is pretty cool. Even the Decca driver took that over with Common Rider Decayed. And of course, here is the back part. And on the top, it does have a little window so that you can see everything. And it does have the Deno, Deno system written across the top. You do have a little bit of detailing on the back. There's a little plus sign on the back. Reminds me of some kind of like medical thing. And I think these take two or three AAA batteries, I don't remember. And I don't want to uh, waste time finding a pin to figure out. So just, it takes some amount of AAA batteries, I know that much. Uh, unless I'm horribly mistaken on the AAA batteries. Um, but, um, yeah, that is uh, it, so I'm going to switch over to the Rider Cam. So, yeah. Whoa, the chair is, the chair is sitting on the almost fell over, so uh, I'm going to focus that as soon as I put the belt on. So, eh. I'm just going to move that, put it around me. Flip it into place. There you go. Ta-da! Actually, I think that's out of focus, so let me refocus the camera as best I can. Scoot my chair in, and there you go. So, turn it on. There's a switch up top here. Now, by itself, this does have a magnet in here, so this works via a magnet system. So, you can even use a refrigerator magnet to make this work. So, really, so anything metal will cause this to react. You can't do it extremely fast, like in the show, but I guess the side with the magnet would help. But, oh well. So, there is no platform henching, like in the complete selection belt, which I do want. But, oh well. But there is the other henchins. So we got sword, the sword form button. Just press it. The ever famous sword form tune. Henshi. This lets Momotaros take over, and we have become Deno Sword Form. Now there is an attack function, which is where you hold down the pass to do full charge. Like so. It just does the same thing with a different light. I will show it off, though, either way. So yeah, pretty cool. Next up is Rod Form. Henshin. Which is to the blue light. Um, so, yeah. Bokuni. Suvarite Miru. So, uh, Urataros takes over. And now we're in rod form. Hold it down for the full charge. Next is axe form. Henshin! So Kintaros takes over for axe form. Full charge. And then uh, uh, gun form, which if you've seen my review for the Kiwami Lock Seed, I explained they have a similar system because the purple light isn't a purple light. It's a mixture of red and blue. It worked a lot better with the Kiwami Lock Seed because it didn't have the crystal pattern that this belt has. So, I like how over the years they improved on that whole system with the color mixing thing. But with, but with this belt, it's kind of very odd. I'm not sure if you can tell on camera, but it's very off for me. 
変身倒せよいいよね答えは聞いてない<笑> uh, My imagining impressions I think only King Taros was off of me but whatever Full charge Come on I do like how there's this little thing up here this little uh, clear window here so that I can see the lights even though I'm because this is pretty flat it's very sleek too I like the sleek design of this belt um, so yeah that's basically all this thing can do now if you're a huge fan of Kamen Rider you need this belt because every Kamen Rider fan should know who Deno is and should want anything from Deno at all so pick this up this is extremely worth it very very nice um so yeah until then i will see you guys later take care